sweep it is! Rudy takes down Billy, three games to none. Rico needs a cornhole or this thing is over. 20 no! Stream Stadium in New York City. Welcome back to another edition of Soul Streams presented by High Noon Hard Seltzer alongside Kelly Keegs, Jake Marsh on hand. Now, Kelly, that was an electric start to our broadcast here. Uh, but now all the focus shifts to Cornhole where you at home can win $500 cash. Absolutely, you can. And you're right, Jake, that was, that was an electric start to this. And congratulations to you for quite a performance. Thank you very My much. My gosh. Thank you. Um, but let's move on to our triple headed triple header today and speaking of electric it is nothing short of that introducing the lineup today starting things off you saw him in here earlier today it's Frank the Tank Fleming against Barstool Big Cat and then our second match will be Robbie Fox against Jeff D. Lowe and then we'll end things with the battle of the bench mob between Rico Bosco and Marty Mush which match Kelly are you looking forward to the most I'm looking forward to this one right here because I do want to see how Frank handles this uh, this match. But I think I'm most looking forward to Marty and Rico. I think that that is going to be um, an emotional round. And I love the drama. I love the emotion. So oh, I can't wait to see absolutely. it. Absolutely. And you've seen Rico firsthand how crazy he can get. Of course. You of can course. only imagine with someone like Marty, uh, someone, he's just going to try to tee off on him as much exactly, as possible. Exactly. Exactly. We're just going to have to see how it plays out. But I'm very much looking forward to it. Absolutely, just dealing with this little uh, tangling issue, but I think we're all good to go. <laughs> yes. Um, is this is this over too far? Oh no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Um, but let's now lock in on our first match right now. It's Big Cat versus Frank the Tank. If you pull up the tail of the tape of this one, uh, Big Cat is looking for Frank the Tank. Big Cat is one and zero in his cornhole career. He took down Tommy Smokes in the fall, uh, and then Frank the Tank. He's zero and one. A loss to Brianna Chicken Fry a couple of weeks ago. But, Kelly, the story with Frank the Tank in this room, he's never won I'm anything. Not. Is today the day? I'm I, not 220 pounds. Okay. I don't know when I filled that out. We'll make note of that, sir. Just going to throw that out there. Um, I, I actually know a little bit about Frank's background here because I sit diagonally from him at my desk, and he often talks about how he never wins in this room and how he'll never win in this room, and he's very, very um, negative about it. So I'm looking forward to seeing how he reacts. And if he does start to get a little bit hot, uh, maybe some positivity will finally come out of Frank the Tank. Well, he All calls right, it, there's Frank. He calls it the curse of Seamus Fleming. Seamus, I believe, is his great-grandfather. Oh, goodness. I believe that's when things – Okay, I stand corrected. Six um, greats. Six, six generations. Six generations. That is when, according to Frank, things started to turn south for the Fleming family. So now Frank's here to try to twist that. I, I do understand that family curses do last for a really long time, and I hope that Frank is the one that gets to break it. All right, well, now it is time. We have both of our competitors here inside the Triple S, Big Cat and Frank the Tank. Hey, and want, as always inside the Triple S, each on? player will pitch all four bags simultaneously. I got and then whoever has the most points will no, decide I I if they go first or second in our opening match. Wait, what? Each player will pitch all four bags Why at don't the same we just, time. Can we just do rocks, paper, scissors, shoot for it? No, I like this. Oh. All right, okay. Oh. All right. Frank has Frank, not a fan. Get by Frank right yes. away. <laughs> Remember, I got swept in rocks. <laughs> yeah. All right, okay. Big Cat gets roasted. All right, same time. One. Oh, we throw them all at the same time. Oh, I see. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm down with that. All right, here we go. One. Big Cat in blue. Three. Frank oh, in yellow. Oh, fucking my. false start. <laughs> oh, Big my. Cat gets one point, so now Big Cat decides whether he will go first or second. I'll go second. My goodness. Jake, I have to say, not a Frank, single yellow you bag me out even there. coming close to the board is, nope. is a little bit. discouraging little for Frank. I, All I right. gotta mention no, I that. To so, All right, Big I'll go Cat second. will defer. So, here goes Frank the Tank to start things off. He's pitching in yellow, and away we go inside Stool Stream Stadium. Remember, each match is first to 21, win by two, and you can go over that number. As Frank's mm. a little short there, each player has one bag on the board right now. The, Kelly, that's what we call a woody. It's, one, it's worth a one woody. point, 
and it's on the board. Interesting. Okay. Ooh, that one was almost close. Frank the Tank, his first career pitch against Brianna Chicken Fry a couple wash. weeks ago. So that's a wash because it's three on versus three on. So there's mm -hmm. no points awarded for those who aren't familiar with the scoring. Um, Frank the Tank's first career pitch a couple of weeks ago, it was a cornhole. So as negative as this man is, he's not as bad as he leads on. I, I, I do. Tell, I have right. uh, learned that right. about him. I think that he has some positivity that he wants to let out. All right. Frank the Tank a little too strong there. And Big Cat responds with a cornhole. Goodness. That's our first. And you see that bottom right of your screen, the total cornhole mark as Big Cat goes two for two. That's what we're tracking in question two, the total cornholes in this game alone. And Big Cat oh has goodness. the chance for what we call a four bagger. Can he do it early? Yes, he wow. can. The father of two makes a statement early on. Wow. Nicely done by Dan. That is 10 points for Big Cat. And Frank does not look happy. Not at all, but I will say Frank is throwing a little bit better. He's just warming up at this point. You know what I mean? He might sink a couple bags. Now you see, or you may see, a I negative go, right? vibe from Do Frank the yep. Tank. I caught with, up with him on Monday, and we had a quote that was published. As Big Cat has made five in a row right My now. Goodness. He's looking to make quick work here. He's on fire. Uh, I ah. asked Frank the Tank what he expects in this match. He said, Big Cat will beat me because I never win in that room. He what was saying that this morning as well. Yep. And I asked, all right, Frank, what do you have to do in order to get a win? He said, I don't know, because if I did know, I'd win. I have no luck ever. Right now, there are 18 Mets on the IL and five more by the end of the week. He needs Big Cat to get drunk. That's what he says his only chances of winning. I wish that he had asked me ahead of time. I would have slipped something into Dan's drink. He would have never known. All right. That's seven more <laughs> points for Big Cat. It's this 17 love right now. Of all time. <laughs> Frank just... Has no <laughs> hope, according to himself. But Big Cat's oh up yeah, first. Man. Whoever wins the round gets the honor. This could become a very quick match as we pull up the numbers oh, Frank. of the pick percentages. Big Cat 2-0 picked by 75%. In fact, Frank the Tank in a sweep, it's the smallest number we've ever had inside oh. Stool Stream Stadium. That is two Frank. points wow. for Big Cat, by the way. So... Or three, yeah, two points, so 19 nothing. What I was saying, Kelly, Frank the Tank 2-0, 2.33%. Oh. The l l biggest long shot in the history of stool streams. My goodness. I mean, I, I don't know what to, what to say about his bad luck. It does seem as if it's a curse. That's how bad it is. Yep, the curse of Seamus Fleming. It is 19 nothing. a beatdown here inside the Triple S. Question two, the 0 to 20 mark was actually the most popular and that looks like where we're heading right now. That, uh, Ooh, total cornholes game one, picked by 51%. There, so if Big Cat can close it out here, it'll be well within that 0 to 20 range. There's a lot of pile up around the hole, it seems, Jake. I, I don't normally see that wash. when I see cornhole. Yep, that's a wash, three on three. Yeah, a lot of traffic is what we call it around the hole right now. But for Frank the Tank, a wash is a win because you're not losing any points. You're absolutely correct. Nope, I'm going to get shut out. I'm going to lose 21, 21, nothing, 21, nothing. <laughs> Frank? Staying positive. Just always, as always. Yeah, but Frank, we're friends, so. Oh, not even close. Guys being yeah, dude, nope. you know? Didn't even hit the board. You know, Love last time, as Big Cat nails a cornhole, and this one's all but over, most likely. Big Cat is very good Oh, at an game. airmail oh, wow. for Big Cat. He's really showing off now. Frank too strong. That's three cornholes Nicely for Big done. Cat, and that's it. It is 28 nothing. the biggest blowout in Stool Stream's history. Sorry, Frank. Frank on the My wrong goodness. side of history today. Oh, Frank. You know the Mets are going to get no hits tonight. Frank, I love means. you. That's what this means. Well, you know I love in you. In fact, the Mets are going to be no hit in five of the next six games. Frank, maybe the bad luck all happened here in Stool Stream Stadium, and tonight the Mets are going to be fantastic. Yeah, maybe you're taking one for the team, Frank. No shot. So I'm going? Yeah, Big Cat leads off. It's set number two after a 28-0 historic beatdown over on, the 45-year-old from it's Belleville, New hey, Jersey. That was a little wow. too much. Come on, Jake. Historic beatdown. Yeah, it might have been the biggest beatdown <laughs> of all time, but that doesn't need to be said. All Jake does my is guy talk Frank. Yes. I, mean, the, 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 I need I need to start negative vibes. Negative vibes <laughs> only. <laughs> because positive vibes do not exist. Yeah, exactly. That is what yeah, Frank yeah. told yes, me also do. in our uh, pregame chat. So here's set number two. Uh, question two is already in the books. As Big Cat starts off with the cornhole. Now, if you're looking at this glass half full for Frank, which 
in his eyes, he probably can't. There is no such thing as a glass half full. It's half empty, and the glass is leaking. Uh, you can't really <laughs> fault yourself because Big Cat's playing pretty well right now. So I don't really know oh, let's who go, the Frank. opponent matter. He's I'm playing scored, fantastically. It's, it's, I feel as if I'm at some sort of like frat barbecue, and he is like just the best one there. You know, that's yeah. how Good I'm feeling job. right now. Big Cat gets one point. So Frank limits the damage with a cornhole. I believe that was his first of the day. Um, but it's still one point for Big Cat. We talked a lot about Frank's right. pregame interview uh, with me. Uh, Big Cat did not cooperate. He does not do interviews with me. No, me no cooperation. Quotes. Nope. Interesting. That's not that. Did you feel as if he was uh, acting like a diva a little bit? That well, to he's me. been doing that since day one. Do you oh want to say goodness. why? You just said I don't do the interviews. I know. My exact quote was. Uh, the Israel-Palestine situation is weighing heavy on my heart, mm. and I do not want it. It's just a game here. That's what I said. You okay, well, to be honest, fair I think that's a very things. fair and I did the Kyrie answer. Irving. It puts things in perspective, for sure. <laughs> it certainly does. It makes us think some things are bigger, you know? Yes. Bigger than cornhole, bigger than sports. Well, speaking ah! of bigger than sports, Rico Damn and Marty are main event today. Uh, but that is... Five, four. Four more points for Big Cat. It's five love. You know, usually Frank the Tank rants. He's being relatively quiet today. He seems to be yeah, a, I don't a bit of a broken man. talk about the man. Mets around me. Ooh, there it is. Well, he already brought up they're getting rant. no he hit. talk about the Mets. Who are they playing tonight? The Rockies? Yep, and the Rockies already have a case. See what you for did, Congratulations Jake. See what for you no did, hitter. Jake. You there it the is. Mess. No, you did it. You were like. And Louis Rojas is the one. See what you did, Jake. You did Louis this. Louis Rojas is the one that baked the cake, it's saying, all right, saying all right. that, that he can't wait to sing Praise You. All right, back to no Mets. I, I, we'll talk about it after, but I agree with you. All right, five love in favor of Big Cat. Let's see if Frank the Tank can get on the board here. It was 28 0 in set Maybe one. If I try left handed, I'll have better luck. Oh. <gasps> oh, that's short. Oh, my. Frank tries lefty a little bit. Crowds the hole. It's wide left, though. Big Cat just short to the right. Frank. Frank might be a lefty. A little bit more, and Big Cat knocks one in and on. Frank, a little too strong. And that is four points for Big Cat. He leads 11 0. I have to say, I'm watching Dan go back and forth and collecting these bags, and it looks tiring. I'm tired watching it from up here. All right. Nine nothing, excuse me. Nine nothing. Let's see if Frank the Tank can get a point here. Big Cat starts off with a cornhole. Frank's too strong. Big Cat, wide right. Frank just hauling him in right now. Big Cat hits two. Too much from Frank. Oh my, that a was lot of power. just a little high. Seven points for Big Cat. 16 nothing right now. The entirety of this match, Kelly, it's 40. The Mets will not zero. score another run in May. <laughs> what? That's it's actually wait, not too crazy. 25. There's only five it's days left. Six. That's okay. You guys can still survive that. Nope. Jake, I'm not sure if you could feel right, it from the go. booth, but I could feel the anger on that last bag throw. Yeah, I really just... felt it from here. Yeah, our Frank Heinen, is down bad. Our Heinen Hard Seltzer sideline experience guests need to watch out. They absolutely do. Heinen Hard Seltzer, just 100 calories. Here we go. Green Rally time. Sugar. Oh, my it's goodness. It's real vodka, real juice for real Was fans just like closed? us. Yes. Hashtag Was neuters. Frank Jordan goes with the on? rally cap. Big Cat responds with a Woody. Oh, overhand. Overhand. <laughs> and it's not close. A little short, yes. This seems to be an underhand game. Oh, Boom. Frank. Frank. Oh, that, Ooh, I oh, think that's Frank. legal. A bounce? <laughs> I don't know if there's any rules that say that's not <laughs> legal, but it's five points for Big Cat, and it's enough. That oh, is it? a sweep for Big Cat. 28 nothing, 21 nothing. Oh my God. I, you know, I didn't think that it was going to happen like this, but I shouldn't have been so surprised, I guess. Knowing about the curse, knowing about the history. I didn't believe you suck at everything. Uh, that's not true. It's it. Uh, hot dog reviews. You're great on the yak. You're a great blogger. Soda reviews. Uh, putt putt. Uh, you got a million friends. Uh, fact, You're I down a hundred pounds. In fact, in putt putt, I was called by the Putt Putt Association of America so bad they don't want to even associate with me anymore. In fact, I I, I don't uh, like that negative energy. I shot a. Uh, I played putt putt on Sunday. I got uh, a fifty. Uh, what was it? no? Uh, a 108, I got sixes on every hole. Well, that is impossible, that bad. Frank. That's, that's that tough. Bad. There's no way. No, that's, there's a way. I uh, had one, one Way to go, putt. Jake. I had a one-inch putt. 
He doesn't have his and mic on anymore. Spun around the hole three times and then shot out. Spun around the hole three times and then it shot out. I just want to say right now, I, I, uh, that this was Frank was kind enough to play me. This was really just so I could get on the bag stadium in Stool Stream Stadium to call out Rico Bosco. Oh, I want to call out Rico Bosco. I'm coming for Rico Bosco. I heard he's the biggest, baddest guy in town. I will take him down. I showed it. I will take him down. All right. So Frank and I had planned that. Thank you, Frank. Wow. What do you make of that development, Kelly? Because Big Cat just won on aggregate 49 to nothing. Should Rico be worried? Honestly, after the performance that Big Cat just gave, I think, yes, Rico should be worried, especially if he is specifically calling him out, calling for blood. Rico, uh, he better watch out. Remember, Big Cat's a rider. So. Of course he is, but still, they have their tit and tat, and they go back and forth, and they argue occasionally, and I would hate to see a friendship end over something like this. All right, one more note on this match. It's our Roman swipe of the match, and I mean, for Frank the Tank, there aren't really many highlights for Frank. <laughs> However, there are plenty of lowlights. He did not get one point the entire match. Many lowlights. The, the lack of any points whatsoever was did feel like salt in the wound, I will say. However, Frank did make a cornhole with his left hand, tried the rally cap, it wasn't enough, but it is still our Roman swipe of the match. Most guys have tried different ways to last longer, but thinking about cornhole doesn't always work. The folks at Roman and Online Men's Health Company are changing the game with Roman swipes. The secret to longer lasting sex. Go to GetRoman.com slash dreams. You can get your first month of swipes for just $5 when you choose a monthly plan. That's GetRoman.com slash streams. All right. Our first match is in the books. Now I